So she's up and running. She's spinning really, really, really fast. I don't want to get near it at all. It's not even scared being right here, but it's good. It's good. See if I can get in her angle, you can actually see the real speed of it. Apparently not. This camera is not going to be able to slow it down either. We can see the actual true speed of it. You can just tell how fast it really is moving now. By the way, the bending of the blades are. Give you an idea if you look at the one the tips on that video there there is a marking on the actual blade where I can read it with an RPM gauge and if you look at it closely you can see how fast it spins by every time but of course it's still being slowed down She's spinning back up again We're just having an awful winds today where they're going back and forth. They're not staying very steady, so that's why I'm going to get a bigger tail on it. Try to see if I can control it a little better. And uh, soon I'll be updating my battery bank, showing uh, my battery bank. I really didn't clean it up much. I've been super busy with my other businesses. But when I get a chance, I will definitely get y'all an updated uh, view of what's going on down there. So far, it's done really well, especially with all the power that we had. Oh boy, that's some good wind right there. As I said, it's very turbulent right now. Back and forth, back and forth. If you look at the trees, you can kind of get that. They're just going left to right, back and forth. You know, same as the one behind it and everything. She's slowing down now. I'm gonna go down in the basement and try to read some of these readings. the place. Well, that's update on that. Unfortunately, I wish I could show y'all where it's being behaving and staying still, but like I said, the winds are flurrying around and the tail is a little too small that I got out of pyre now. <laughs> 